Litecoin price prediction October 2020. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'll be providing you guys an update on Litecoin. So guys, Litecoin has got some fairly big news that Litecoin testnet launch, the Mimble, Wim, Mimble Wimble fueled privacy launch. So Litecoin Charlie Lee is looking at fungibility and privacy for Litecoin so I'll give you guys an update on the project and guys I'll be talking about the price so I've not really talked about Litecoin as much so I'll be sharing with you some key levels to buy if you like Litecoin some key levels to buy take profit level some targets if it does break out share with you a trading strategy that I'm looking at personally so guys I've not really made a Litecoin video for a while I think the last one I make was about three months ago you can see where it was um, Litecoin was breaking out above this zone and uh, you can see the resistance I had drawn uh, this big red zone resistance which is the 618 level and it rejected from there and it's dropped about 30% so again if you guys traded this level it was a nice trade to take a breakout out of this around 25% you could have got and now it's rejected and I said if it gets rejected please look to take profit I wanted to give you guys an update because you know if there's not much to update there's no point making videos but it's at, it's at a key zone now and people have been messaging me about a potential Litecoin pump uh, because you know the Mimble Wimble testnet launch and guys I'm not really interested it's getting rejected of the daily moving average so the key the most key zone I can see is the $40 level if Litecoin breaks below $40 level guys I won't be holding Litecoin Litecoin could drop a lot further if it just spikes down does something like this that's fine i'll still be in litecoin but if not guys i'm not going to be interested in litecoin from a trading point of view i'll be sharing with you a trading strategy at the end but let's have a quick look at some news so main news like i talked about is the testnet launch if you follow litecoin foundations on twitter or if you are in the reddit groups you'll see this this is a really big news and there are some partnerships that are going on but from my point of view guys litecoin has been fairly quiet you know it was one of the major players silver to gold bitcoin being gold and uh, there's lots of news on you know like light pay and what they're trying to do now it just seems really quiet and the price has just been trending down and my interest in litecoin from I, I am interested in fungibility and what they're trying to do and I, I do like that but i'm not really you know looking at it as a future i need to see more i need to see you know adoption and maybe you know people using litecoin and fungibility that brings new risks as well because you know fungibility and privacy some coin some exchanges might not like that so that brings added risk of you know being a potentially a privacy coin although you know monero and zcash are doing well watch zcash guys i mean if i get 100 likes i usually share a coin that pumps as zcash is the free coin that i'll be looking at so make sure you give 100 likes you know i shared with you some coins that could pump if I get 100 likes in each video, I'll share that again. So make sure you smash that like button. And if you want to take your train to the next level, guys, you know, check out our group. I'll leave the links below, guys. I do live streams three to four times a week. And one of the uh, trades I talked about was that Bitcoin uh, breakdown. Rec I recommend you watch that. And, you know, this was the uh, levels that I was looking for. So, you know, in the YouTube videos, I share with the exact levels I'm buying, coins I'm looking at. In the educational video, I'll share with you a strategy. You get access to what trades I'm taking, what levels I'm looking to buy. And there's Telegram group as well. If you're interested, I'll leave the links below. If not guys make sure you smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button so let's carry on with litecoin so that those are my thoughts on litecoin i'm not as big a fan litecoin used to be like i said one of my favorite coins i won't tell the story again you know how much i used to like litecoin and the issues with light pay and charlie Lee selling at the moment i really want to see what happens with fungibility and i talked about the added risk of you know being a privacy coin or you know fungibility but what mimbo Wimble is doing and what cryptocurrency is about uh, this could be a new avenue for Litecoin. I'll, I'll have to see more before I get interested. And I'm more of a trader. I'm not invested in Litecoin. I want to see what price does. So the key level is forty dollars. If price comes into this level, you can look for a trade uh, for a little bounce. Again, you need to you need to make sure you have a strategy. You can on a shorter time frame. There should be a bounce from there. And what I'm looking for is I'm not looking to buy now. You know this pump. Uh, I don't really like it. I need it to. I need to see Litecoin above sixty dollars for a trade around sixty five dollars. That would be a trade. You know this is a big resistance. Uh, Litecoin is at. So if it gets above the daily moving average, gets above 382 Fibonacci level, I'll look for a trade. For longer term breakouts, it needs to break out above 64. This was the key zone I shared with you last time. And I'll be waiting for that. If it doesn't get above it, I won't trade. Like XRP, I talked about 30 cent. If XRP gets above 30 cent, I'll be interested. If not, I'll just keep waiting. I won't buy. If it does break below this, guys, I won't be that interested. And the next buy zone would be sort of the $20. $20, $25 is where I'll buy long term Litecoins. And Litecoin seems to always have pumped from here 
it might not be as big a pumps you know as we've seen back in 2018 you know litecoin halving and all that but there should be a you know i'd say 70 60 100 percent pump from this zone and if litecoin breaks out above 80 dollars that's uh, 60 dollars those are the sort of levels for xrp and 30 dollars then we can have a big move you know this would be a trend change in litecoin if it breaks out above 80 and 64 dollars that's when we can get a big move if it breaks above 20 breaks below 20 dollars guys i don't think it will it will have a big bounce we'll have to see against litecoin b TC, it's already breaking a key level guys i don't really like that we've seen you know when supports are broken i can give you loads of examples of xlm and other coins it can go down a lot if it stays like this guys this will be really bearish for like when you know i would prefer bitcoin you know if you look at ethereum ethereum btc is in an uptrend whereas litecoin is in a downtrend you don't want to be in coins that are in a downtrend so just my thoughts if you love litecoin in, from an investing point of view you know that's your thoughts you know you could sell half and then trade with half on loads of people in my group that trade that love some coins like litecoin xrp or theta chain link they trade with half and hold or half yeah, that's fine but and if it's below it i'd rather not be interested you can follow simple investing advice you know just use a weekly moving average or just learn a trading strategy it's really important to have a trading strategy so short time frame if it breaks down i will be bearish on litecoin long time long time frame like i said i'm massively bullish on crypto uh, the post i made you know one bitcoin is one bitcoin although i've been bearish on btc i'm massively bullish on crypto long term so you know uh, i'll end it on that note guys one btc is one btc so long term guys are massively bullish on on crypto and especially on bitcoin so thank you very much for watching this video guys uh, to end the video my question to you guys is what is your thoughts on litecoin do you like Litecoin as a project? Do you think it's going to have a big, you know, 300%, 200% breakout above those key levels? Tre change trend in the weekly time frame or, uh, you know, fungibility and Litecoin testnet launch gets more uh, views. Just comment on your fundamentals and your price predictions for Litecoin and let's have a discussion. And if anything interesting happens, like it breaks down or breaks out, I'll make another video to update you guys. So make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much.